this is in to the most high. I just want to say that people only I could identify judgment when it's with somebody, someone else's nation or with someone else. They don't see judgment when it's about them or their nation. The problem is that God judges us individually or he'll judge us as a whole people, a whole nation. You can read Ezekiel, you can read Amos, and just Isaiah, you can read all through your Bible. Judgment for Moab, judgment for Esau, judgment for Edom, judgment for Israel, judgment for Canaan, judgment for, do you understand? Judgment for Egypt. So you can't pick and choose which Bible scriptures apply to you, all right? Um, people really don't understand God's judgment. He who leads into captivity shall go into captivity. He who kill it with a sword shall must be killed it with a sword. You're going to reap what you sow. Just like you've seen the, is, the children of Israel reap what they sown in your sight when God said he's going to judge them and he's going to distribute them in through the four corners of the earth and they lived out Deuteronomy 28. What makes you think that, um, that you're not going to live out the punishments that God set up against the other nations? And I tell you, if you want to escape those judgments, you have to repent. You have to repent individually. You have to pe repent for your nation. And I tell you that, remember, God recompenses up into the third and fourth.